Dog ears can be found in all shapes and sizes, but why should one be erect and the other is not? Find out everything you need to know in our Animal Wise video and why a dog has one floppy ear. It is only aesthetic. In some dogs, the ears are naturally erect. When one or both ears hang down in this type of dog, it can cause concern for their caregiver. If we don't observe other symptoms, the dog's floppy ear may simply be an aesthetic issue which doesn't imply any repercussions for their health. In addition, we need to take into account the fact that all puppies will have floppy ears. It's not until around five to eight months of age their ears will become erect, something which can happen in one ear before the other. However, if the dog's ears don't raise after around a year of age, it's possibly due to genetic issues. If their parents don't have erect ears, it is unlikely that they will. In a small minority of cases, a dog's ears may be floppy due to dietary problems or certain health issues, which we explain further here. Discover how to clean a dog's ears in the first info video in the corner. Bite wounds. When a dog is in a fight, it's not uncommon for their ears to become injured. This is because they are one of their most vulnerable and accessible areas. Bite wounds are often complicated by infections. Except for minor injuries, they should receive veterinary attention and may even require surgery to prevent deformation. Sometimes our dog has one floppy ear due to inflammation. In these cases, the swelling can be due to an abscess or a hematoma, the latter of which occurs when blood collects under the skin. When bites become infected, pus can accumulate under the skin, but otherwise appear fine. Ear hematoma, known as autohematoma, usually appear when the dog shakes their head vigorously or scratches their ear. In these cases, it's necessary to find out what is causing the discomfort and itching that the dog is trying to alleviate. Both abscesses and autohematomas have to be seen by a veterinarian. Check the info videos for a related video on why dogs lift their front paws. Otitis media. This is inflammation which usually stems from the outer ear. The dog shakes their head, scratches the affected ear, feels pain, and can develop a foul smelling discharge. Otitis media can injure part of the facial nerve connected to the eardrum. In these cases, we may observe the upper lip drooping as well as the affected ear being floppy. It's essential a veterinarian cleans the ear and prescribes oral antibiotics to treat any underlying infections. In chronic cases, surgical intervention may be required. Otitis media can be prevented if we take them to the vet when we see the initial onset of symptoms. Early intervention usually prevents the ear becoming permanently floppy. On the other hand, if the dog doesn't receive timely assistance, it's possible the damage to the ear can be permanent. This is unfortunately common in abandoned or feral dogs. This is because they don't have caregivers to introduce treatment and allow the ear to recover and once again become erect. If you want to learn more curiosities about dogs, check out the playlist we share here. Tell us if your dog has a floppy ear by leaving a comment below and we'll see you next time.